Hey guys, what's up? This is Zako1017, and I'm doing a Let's Play on Medieval 2 Total War. I decided to do this series because it was on sale, so I thought, hey, let's do this. So, I will be doing the Holy Roman Empire, as requested by Davy, and it's 1080 AD. Uh, the strengths are strong all around, but it lacks professional armies, so they're a little behind on... Um, soldiers in general so let's just start no advice because it's annoying a uh, long campaign and medium difficulty for battles so let's do this Okay, see you, Dave. Horrible way to die. Okay, we're done. Let's get on with the game. So I'm mostly gonna just be building up my armies in the beginning and my talents just trying to gain epi economic like power so I can just be safe. I don't wanna just waste all my money right away, so so pretty much we're stretching from all the way to the coastline in the north to the coastline to the south in Italy. So I'm probably gonna be Reinforcing the edges of the empire and probably right here too in Nuremberg. And let's see, let's just build some dirt road, some farming. Do I have money for that? I'll wait. I just want to make sure everyone has a dirt road so traveling is easier from city to city. Dirt road, maybe we can expand that if we can. Wait for a second. Actually, we should do the mining right here. Where is that? Uh, 2000. Let's just wait. Uh, dirt road. Dirt road. Probably has dirt road already. Surprisingly, no. Dirt road and. Dirt road. Okay. So we got the dirt roads. Let's see if we can build an army right here. I'll be using an army here. Okay. Emperor should have better troops. Maybe some town militia, just one more right there. Uh, unknown right here. We don't know if there's enemies over there. At least I don't. I haven't played this yet. I want archers. They're always good. And to the north, there's rebels. They're well defended there. Let's see Nuremberg. Let's see. I think they should use one more town militia. And Vienna. Maybe just one more town militia. And merchants. See what it does. Okay, we'll do that later. But let's see, just right now, let's see what we can do at the end of the turn. Speed this up a little bit. We got a diplomat. Definitely. We need allies. Let's see if we make an alliance here. Good. Okay. We got an ally. That's always good to have. Let me turn up the game volume, actually. It's a little quiet. Just a 
lot quiet actually. Let's turn up a little more special effects. There, that's that's what it was special effects. Uh, music. Don't really want any music. Okay, We're good. Probably should have subtitles maybe. I don't know. I'll just have subtitles if you guys want it off. Then just tell me. Okay. Let's see. Uh, grid relations alliance. Uh, 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 strongest faction. That's always good. And largest faction. Uh, we lost three thousand. Not very good, but we'll be able to get that out hopefully. Let's see. Any moves here? Okay. No. Okay. So I think I might attack this town actually. Let's see how big it is. Dead. No, okay. They have a good garrison. Take a little bit to get them in actually. So let's just try to build up our armies around here. How's that in the north? There's people there. How's the Danish? Okay. Don't want to attack them. Yeah, you know, I don't know if that our army's big enough there. I think I might march them south towards here. And on the way, we can um, give them some troops from here. Or from here. Can we? Um, how about we descend? We build some troops here. Wait, where's our base city? Build some troops. You know, this is the most military advanced city right here. So, first of all, let's just build it up so we can do this better.